A simulation fixture is any part that is fixed in the context of the assembly. A simulation requires at least one fixed part. Typically with an assembly, it is a recommended workflow to only have one fixed component. This workflow ensures no floating components when that assembly is inserted into another assembly if it is fully mated. When more than one part is fixed or mated to the origin in an assembly, a warning icon is visible on those parts. Hover over the warning icon to read the tooltip. The warning more than one part is fixed does not impede a simulation. There are simulation circumstances where having multiple fixtures is intuitive. If the warning is undesirable for a particular assembly, consider creating another assembly specifically for setting up simulations or creating a configuration for the simulation. This enables the original assembly to maintain its performance in higher assemblies, while the new assembly or configuration is constrained appropriately to prevent rigid body motion. Let's take a look at an example of an assembly where a fixture needs to be created for the context of a simulation. In this assembly, a ground part is created and inserted twice. These ground parts are fixed to represent where the drive shaft assembly is mounted. With two fixed parts in this assembly, the warning icon is visible on those fixed parts. For the purpose of this simulation example, it is intuitive to have two fixed parts where the assembly is mounted. True to product creation. The simulation runs successfully with more than one fixed part. This video discussed creating fixtures for a simulation and introduced workflows to isolate simulations when a sub-assembly performance in a higher assembly must be maintained.